Good morning, second graders. This is Miss Marks here with the next week's lesson for code. We're going to work on lesson seven, creating art with code. By the end of this lesson, you're going to be able to create a program to complete an image using sequential steps, one, two, three, four, and break complex shapes into simple art because art is really nothing more than shapes. If you listen to Miss Shaw in art class, she starts talking about draw this shape, this shape, and that's how you get started. And in computers, we only have shapes. So, I'm gonna watch this video, then the other video, and then we'll get started with the lesson. Okay, now we're just going to go back to this other video because it's going to explain how to do those angles for you. Okay, so that's going to help you out a little bit with your um, code and doing this process. So let's look at number two. Do whatever you want. I'm not going to do anything here. You draw some lines, turn them around, do what you want to do, press finished. Number three should be the actual. Okay, now we need to finish this one. So let's finish this code. Now, 
please listen to the directions as you go through because they will always tell you how long the lines are. Fourth and fifth graders don't like to do that part. And jumping is not putting down a line. You have to draw to draw, move a line. And then I'm going to turn right. That's three out of four. I'm going to just put that last one in because I only have one more block anyway. Um, I could change the color. Don't really want to here. Please don't put it on the turtle. Put it closer to the rabbit so he actually doesn't take a long time to draw. If you put him on the rat, on the turtle, he takes a very, very long time to draw. Okay. Okay, once again, the directions tell us how long the pixels are and what degree measure to turn. So let's see where we are. Okay, so now I need to move forward. And then the turn right again. I only have five blocks, so I'm good. Now watch how slow, I'm gonna put it on the turtle this time. Watch how slow he draws. He draws really slow. Okay, so now we need to move forward, turn right. So you can see there that it, when you put it on the rabbit, he goes a lot quicker and you won't be sitting there for so long. Wait a minute, I got a light green there. Hold on, let me go back and look at that one. what I do wrong? Ooh, I don't need that last one. See, I went back, I saw that was a light green instead of a dark green and I was like, why just that? I didn't need the last turn right, but I kept putting turn forward, turn right, forward, turn right. Okay, I'll do two more and that's it. Let's see what this one says. Okay, so I can move forward and then let's try turn left. Let's see what that does for me. Okay, I'm on the right path forward, turn left, and again, I don't need that last turn. Just pay attention to the directions, guys. If you need help, you can email me, but if you email me, please stay in the program. Give me five minutes to look at your email and figure out where you are. I can go in, see where you are, what you're doing, also, please give me what classroom you're in. Remember, you're assigned to classes in code.org, and I'll make it a little bit easier for me to find you if I know which class you're in right away instead of trying to go by my memory or look you up in my gradebook. Okay? Have a good day.